YouTube Nation, Main Event TV, aka Me TV, aka Dinosaur Pimp, aka y'all need to see the Eagles' uh, swimsuit calendar, and don't and don't sleep on this, the Sixers chilies either. Very nice. Flies, Ice Girls too. Yeah, y'all get on it. Y'all know what it is. Shout outs to Glowed from Philadelphia Phillies. Who would have thought he'd hit a home run last night? <laughs> Who would have thought? And shout outs to Sergeant Robert Ralston. Now, or is it Ralston? I'm not sure. But if you don't know, breaking news just came out that uh, Sergeant Ralston lied about being shot. Uh, apparently out at 56th Street. Um, apparently, recently he got... Uh, Transferred to the 19th district and because he was so angry about being transferred he shot himself and lied and said an unknown assailant did it and Because of this there were many taxpayer dollars that were uh, Spent there was manhunt uh, They used police dogs. They put out a $10,000 bounty on a random person in that area and as you know 56th Street, you know what you know what you're looking for so I kind of find it funny. And the fact is, this guy won't be charged with anything <laughs> because he was granted immunity for, for confessing. How do you grant immunity for confessing? So no charges will be brought up. You got to love it. And these are Philadelphia cops. Yeah, got to love it. Anyways, <laughs> today I want to talk about the Flyers. That's right, Flyers fans. Good reason to be excited. Last night, we pretty much punched up on Boston and I've been saying it from the beginning what did I say Boston is a dirty team I said all they do is penalty after penalty after penalty and he never got caught with it well looks like last night caught up to him all right they had what eight penalties Chara's flopping like Briere really can knock him down like that come on Chara I told you he sucks anyway all right my problem is Savard Savard he should be suspended and I'm telling you I'm telling you now why all right, Richards hit him from behind. Now, I understand that Boston fans, you want to say, hey, it was boarding. All right, I didn't think he was too close enough to the boards, but if you want to call it, that's fine. That's a legit hockey play. So if it's boarding, then you give that man a penalty. All right, but the penalty wasn't called. Richards walks away. What does Savard do? Cross-checks him in the face. All right, now let me tell you something. All right, when you cross-check somebody, it has to be from the chest and down. So pretty much, that's a penalty. It's a legit hockey play. But when you cross-check somebody in the face, that is an intent to injure. Meaning, guess what? You get ejected from that game, and you get a suspension. They did it with Carcillo a couple months ago. NHL, be fair. Be fair. Be very fair. It's not cool if he gets off with it. And then on top of it, him and who is it? Lucic? 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 I don't know how to say his name. I'm not going to act like I can. They double team. Uh, Richards, Richards and start punching him in the face So it just goes to show you how dirty they can be so it's, it's, it's one man fighting two guys. Yeah, yeah Real fair and the fans are like yeah once again once again the, the fans are so damn classless And then you guys are losing and the fans get so angry. They start throwing things on the ice Real classy This has to be the worst the, the worst fans this year in the playoffs. All right, you guys have not lost at home once in the postseason, and finally you guys do, and you fans are going to bitch about it? Are you serious? Are you serious? Look, you guys got rolled over, all right? And I've been saying this from the beginning, how classless these Boston fans are. Now, I'm, I'm sure there are many Boston fans out there, Bruin fans, who are very classy. You know, being serious, I'm very classy. But these fans that are out there, no, they're not. They're pathetic, all right? The Flyers rolled you over. And then you're going to get mad and start taking out. I told you, they were gooning it up real nice last night. And what did I say in my last video about this? You want to play the goon way? Hey, we from Philly. We know all about that. All right? You really want to get into it. But you guys really don't want to. So now you got to come back to Philly. And Philly fans, I, there shouldn't be a Boston fan in the stands. Not at the walk. No. Not after last night. No. All right? We lost Boucher and we got Leighton back. But it doesn't matter. As long as, what did I say before? That the defense protects the goalie, they won't get many shots. Between Leighton and Boucher, when he played, they saw what? 16, 17 shots, if that? That's, that's not bad. 
And then, on the other end, what did I say? Be aggressive and use the four check. And what's going on? We bowled over him. That's, what, that's, that's how you do it. Scott Hartnell, welcome to the show. About time. But anyways, guys. Like I said, Savard, that, that's my big case today. Savard needs to be suspended for this. And more than likely, he probably won't be suspended. You know, you know how it is. But he should be. And it was a dirty play. It just goes to show you how classless he can be. I understand he got a concussion, but hey, you want to play physical, you want to get nasty, we can get nasty too. Stop oh my head. Oh, I came back and I scored a goal in overtime. No one cares about that shit. Look, the fact is, he should be suspended. Char ain't doing nothing. Half of those teams ain't doing anything. All right? And as yeah, half of them, I'm talking about Montreal. They're they doing a good thing, but they ain't coming back from the Penguins. At least I don't think they are. If they do, more power to them. I would love to see Montreal and the Flyers in the final. Flyers actually have a chance to win this thing now. Just take it one game at a time. One game. All right? Who am I going to see? The Sharks? Who am I see? Chicago? Please. And, oh, Patrick Kane. Patrick Kane. Let me tell you something. Everyone's still riding high on Patrick Kane due to the fact that that, you know, he was in the Olympics and he played well. But are we supposed to forget that this is the same guy who beat up a cabbie not too long ago? Come on. Nah, I'm not going to forget that. I don't care what type of gold medal you got or what type of medal you have around your, your, your neck. I ain't going to forget that. Anyways, Flyers fans, get ready. Wednesday's the day. We got to win that one. And then it's all fair game after that. I would love to see us win on Wednesday. Just to see how many fans Boston shit their pants. It's on. That's simple. It's on. So get ready. I'll talk to y'all then. Be safe. Hit me on the comments. I'm out.